In a year after a cinematographer was killed on the set of the film Rust, prosecutors announcing that actor and producer Alec Baldwin will be charged with two counts of involuntary manslaughter. Fox's Ashley Soriano has more from Santa Fe, New Mexico. Prosecutors here in Santa Fe say a tragic accident on a movie set was the result of criminal behavior. Charges announced Thursday against actor Alec Baldwin and the lead armorer of the film Rust. They're both facing involuntary manslaughter charges in the fatal onset shooting of cinematographer Helena Hutchins. She was killed and director Joel Souza was wounded when real bullets made it into a prop gun that Baldwin was rehearsing with. They had an affirmative duty, an affirmative duty to inspect that gun. Their failure to inspect that gun is the reason why their conduct rise to a level beyond simple negligence. A third person, an assistant director, has agreed to plead guilty to lesser charges. Baldwin and the armorer are now potentially facing years behind bars, but Baldwin's legal team says he had no way of knowing what type of bullets were in the gun. Writing in part, quote, Mr. Baldwin had no reason to believe there was a live bullet in the gun or anywhere on the movie set. He relied on the professionals with whom he worked, who assured him the gun did not have live rounds. During the initial investigation, the Santa Fe Sheriff's Department noted signs of neglect on the set when it came to securing the prop guns. But some legal experts say prosecutors will have an uphill battle, especially if Baldwin, a popular actor for decades, decides to testify. When these high profile individuals, when these celebrities take the stand, mm -hmm. even, even when they're facing criminal charges, they actually don't get, they get exonerated. They don't get convicted. The Santa Fe District Attorney says the charges will officially be filed by the end of the month. In Santa Fe, Ashley Soriano, Fox News.